This is Samsung's new OLED, O-L-E-D screen TV, the S9C. It's 55 inches. The reason $9,000 feels like a bargain is because LG's was $15,000. This is the second kind of widely available commercial OLED TV. And as you might expect with a $9,000 TV, it's loaded. It's got a camera for Skype built in. It comes with not one but two remote controls, one of which is a very innovative universal remote with a touch screen. It also has Bluetooth. This is a Bluetooth remote that has voice control, uh, but you can also use a Bluetooth keyboard and mouse. It'll pair with any of those. And you can even use gesture control. I turned that off because every time I was watching a movie and I scratched my head, the TV interrupted and said, yes, what do you want? I don't know how useful voice control will be, but I do love this remote. It's very, very effective. Another thing that's unusual about this TV is, as you can see, it's slightly curved. Not a lot. The frame makes it look more curved than it is, but the slight curve isn't really necessary. It's just something Samsung could do because the nature of OLED is that you can, it's relatively flexible. Unlike a glass panel, you can bend it. Also, uh, the frame that this is around gives it a nice light, airy appearance and is even more curved. So it appears to be more curved than it actually is. The curve, Samsung says, makes it more immersive. I think it just makes it look different and that's probably good for sales. It's very, very thin, about a half inch thick all the way around. There's no big bulges because all of the electronics on the TV are put in this remote breakout box. It's connected by a proprietary cable to the television. It has on it four HDMI ports, Ethernet, optical out, component, and uh, and this is an infrared blaster, IR blaster for devices to control devices that don't work with the standard protocols, the HDMI CEC protocols. Almost everything does, so you probably won't need to use this infrared blaster. Samsung says the nice the other nice thing about taking this electronics, the smarts, the computer and the TV outside of the TV is this is upgradable. The panel uh, is beautiful, is gorgeous, and if you want to add smarts to the software, you just replace this box and you can do more. There's one other thing this does that's very odd. It has, <laughs> okay, 3D uh, glasses. These are active displays, so you have to charge them up via the attached USB port. But notice they're also equipped with headphones, uh, so you can listen, and that's because uh, there's something in here called multi-view. Okay, this is really weird. but. If you have two people watching one TV and you have multiple inputs into the TV, you can literally watch side by side two different shows. Each of us will get a full screen because when the glasses are shuttered one way, I'll see my show. Shuttered another way, she'll see her show. We get our own separate audio via the built-in earplugs here on the uh, on the headphones. So multi-view is designed to make for happy marriages by letting one person watch one thing. And you can find out more about this fantastic offer by clicking the link in the description.